John? Let's get on. Good. And you? Got everything we need. Good. I think we need another man. Charles? I'll go get him. Meet us at the wagon when you can. Sure. See you, Arthur. Ain't that dumb. <laughs> Next time, let the wolves eat all your brain. Then you'll be a genius. <sighs> Shit. <clears throat> ah. Well, at least it ain't your job. Ah, shut up, Arthur. Yeah, your job's starting the fights. You ain't winning them. Well, you can scrap, Arthur. I'm just no good at homework. I can see. Besides, what do you care, Englishman? You've got no time for me. I tried to find your work, but then you're off cutting jobs with other folks, and your boy Sean doesn't get a look in. Guess I don't want to get shot, that's all. Yeah, you're a real fucking funny shit, Arthur Morgan, huh? Real fucking funny. Calm down. You better sleep with your eyes open. Yeah, well, you're gonna sleep with your chest open if you ain't careful, boy. <laughs> I love you, Arthur Morgan. I love you. Come on, take a shot. Come on, take your best shot, please, eh? Grow up. Hey, let me come on the raid, witches. Raid? Don't be playing coy with me, son. It's unbecoming. That bloody train you and him has set up. What you're doing out here, you're going to need guns. You're going to need men. Oh, that. So Marston told you? It ain't a big show. I need calmness. If I take you, I might as well bring Micah along. Now compare me to that oily toward again. You're a dead man. <laughs> Fair enough. Anyway, Arthur, what's your problem with me? In fact, don't tell me. I already know. You are threatened by me. Threatened by you? Yeah, my youthful vigor. It intimidates you. Does it? It's a story as old as the hills. The changing of the guard, the fading of the light. You're toast, old man. OK. <clears throat> And what are you? I'm the future, in all its glory. Yeah, well, good luck. Good luck and shut up. <laughs> I want to get some rest before nightfall. <clears throat> Wake up, you lazy sir. What are you doing here, kid? I'm coming, John, on the job. I said you weren't coming. Yeah, well, Arthur says I am, and it's his party, boy, so come on, let's go. <laughs> Me and the big cheeses, love it. Can't wait to slit some bastard's throat. You sure about this? No. <laughs> Are we ready? Yeah. Train's due through tonight. All right, then. It's on. Charles? I'm ready. Gentlemen, let's go earn some money. Idiot. Hey, all the horses untethered? I think so. Good. They should follow on behind us. You find a good spot, wolf man? Yeah. Follow the trail southwest. Right. Remember, these are innocent folks. We handle this right, nobody needs to. Yeah. Mr. Marsh. Mr. Smith. Mr. McGuire. Yeah. Get over there. When she slows. Order. And you? I'm gonna make sure she slows. I'll do or die with you. <laughs> I like it. Get moving. I need to get up there. 
Finish up here. Join us on board. Hey, go on! Get on there! Faster. All yours, Captain. We'll go on ahead. People like you make me sick. These two seem to think we're playing games. I'm gonna count to. God damn it! Oh, God. Sick is better Here. than dead, lady. And I'm losing my goddamn patience. Let's just do what he says, so this can be. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a robbery. Let's make this you quick. No, you go ahead and look for the baggage car. Tough cut, huh? Out. You sure about Why that? Why wasting our time? You huh? show this son of a bitch we ain't playing quick, around come here. On. Everything you got. Money, valuables. We ain't leaving until this bag's full. Hey, you won't get a damn cent from me. Let me hand you over to my friend then. Honey, now! Son of a bitch. Come on, cop it up, people. Don't be shy. Just put the gun Everything down, you got. Hey, Let's go. This is unnecessary, please. Come on, sure. Come on. You're better than this. I can handle this from here. You should check on Sean. Okay. Damn it, Arthur. Okay. None of you folks move a muscle. You hear me? What is it? You all right? Fill the baggage car. You all right? Fill the baggage car. For Christ's sake, you ain't even taking a look yet? There's probably something in here, Arthur. Twice a chance of hitting someone. <laughs> Very funny. Some decent stuff. Oh. Oh. I'm gonna have a right old lump on me head. At least you ain't got a hole in it. Are those tennis rackets in there? Harsh bastards. Just keep your eyes peeled. I'm doing me best, all right. I know, that's what's worrying me. Looking good in here. Come on, we should get out of here. These folks are rich, all right. We'll take that. Arthur, we've got a problem. There's two assholes on horses. How many you say? I just see a pair of them. Uh, in that case, we're fighting. Horst Smith, get ready. You men come out the train now, do you hear? We said you men come out now. There's only two of you, you fools. We got a whole lot less to lose. Why don't the two of you ride away? That way neither you get killed. Goddamn liberties. Then, there's a few more of them turning up. Man, my big mouth. 
Okay. Let's deal with them. We won't tell you again. Come out now with your hands up. Fun, boys. Real fun. We can see what they call you the professionals in the outfit. Shut <laughs> up. At least we made some money. Hey, what did I get? Gotta be a hundred dollars here. Very nice. You weren't even invited. <laughs> what now? <laughs> we still need a real big tank. Enough for us to get out of here. Was that a setup? Law turned up real fast. I don't know. I don't think so, but I'm starting to get nervous. Think they followed us from Blackwater? Maybe. They found me already near Horseshoe, but I think this law was just locals. I hope so. I'm gonna head into Valentine, see if I can get something started there. Good idea. Either way, we should all go it alone right now. You know the deal. Don't be followed. Uh, of course not, boss. <laughs> 